This is Alexandra Marichoy from the Marichoy Technique Institute. Today I would like to talk to you about how to activate your core muscles, or how to engage your core. First of all, what is the core? Whereas the core is the midsection of your body. So it's the abdominal muscles, the sides of the abs, the obliques, uh, the back, uh, diaphragm, and uh, hips pel and pelvic floor muscles. So it's basically the trunk of your body. That's why it's called the core. When we talk about core muscles, we usually focus on the abdominal region because it's easier to control and to explain what to do with it. So for this video, we will actually emphasize, the, the, we say the core, but uh, focusing on the abdominal muscle. Why is it important to have a strong core? Well, first of all, the core stabilizes our body. So it prevents lower back pain. So it's very good with back health because it stabilizes everything. Second, you get strength and power. When you get strength, you also perform your exercises and movements throughout the days in a more correct way. So the third one, you avoid the risk of injury. And the fourth one, balance. When you stand on one leg, you think your balance comes from the legs. Well, actually it comes from the core. The core is where everything starts. All the movement, even breathing, and uh, sneezing. How do you activate your core muscles? There are four ways you can understand and activate the core muscles. Number one, deep breathing. This is something really easy you can do uh, just before you fall asleep. Just one minute, but not even one minute, 30 seconds. You take a deep breath in. When you take a deep breath in, the stomach expands, goes out and then you breathe out through your mouth and the stomach goes in. As the stomach goes in, all the muscles tense. Breathe out as much as you can and then when you feel there's nothing left, breathe out more. And here, your abdominal muscles should be as strong as, uh, as a rock or they can become strong as a rock if you do the breathing exercises. Now, if you follow me, you know I have I sh I'm sharing a uh, breathing exercise chapter from my upcoming book. So drop me an email or leave a comment and I'll share it with you. The second way you can activate or engage your core, core muscles. Imagine you are being punched in the stomach. What is your reaction? It's probably going to be something like, yeah, you're going to prepare yourself, brace yourself for the punch. Well, that is a way to activate your core muscles. The third way you can activate or engage your core muscles is to suck your tummy in. Now this is very different from the one breathing and being punched. Because to be honest, if you suck your tummy in when you're being punched, you're gonna be in a lot of pain. Of course you're not gonna be punched, of course. But uh, when you brace yourself for a punch, that is really activating the core. So when you suck your stomach in, the muscles are relatively strong, but not as strong as with the breathing out, where everything goes down and everything is strong, and or uh, bracing for a punch when you go like that. And the fourth way to engage your core muscles is to lie on the ground, uh, face up. You're gonna observe a natural curve in your low back. Now, if you try to flatten the, your low back, that's going to activate your muscles. It's not gonna be a strong muscle activation, but it's good, just good to start with. I'm gonna show you. So I have about, I can slide my hand underneath my back because of the curve in my back. And then I will try to flatten the spine against the ground. And here, my abdominal muscles are activated. And I So if you're a beginner, this is a really good way to start understanding what muscle activation is. When you flatten the spine on the ground, you can also breathe out. So you get used to breathing out. So here we have the benefits of having a strong core and how to activate or engage your core muscles. These are four ways to do it. If you have any further questions, you know how to contact me, leave a comment 
or email me, message me on social media. Thanks for watching.